Howdy folks, and welcome back to another episode of Dark Souls 3. Yippee, right. So in the last episode, we uh, fought two Lords of Cinder, actually. And in this episode, we're going to get started. Is in your hands. Please save his soul. Tell him what he must be. A lord. We're going to get started with a boss fight. <clears throat> Good. Dancer of the Boreal Valley. Super fucking dangerous boss. Let's get it right on into it. This boss is spooky as well. Fun. Of course, there I go, not really explaining much, but, you know, whatever. At first, this boss starts off kind of slow, and, uh, as you progress through the fight, uh, she's got a little bit more aggressive, and, of course, there's a fucking second phase to it all. <clears throat> Excuse me. But yeah, so. Ah, fire blast, great. I don't actually remember a whole lot from this boss, so, you know, there's that. Other than the fact that she turns into, like, a fucking Beyblade. But it's super spooky. Because she does a fuckload of damage. If I do this my first time, I'm going to be impressed. But I don't think I will. We'll see. Apparently I'm just, you know, as far as I'm not. Oh god. How about not? I've, I've entered the school zone here. I'd rather not. I'd really would rather not. What the fuck? I had so much trouble with this boss in my first playthrough. But I beat her in one shot. Well. There's that. Fucking bonfire there. I believe um, this episode is going to be like a three part episode. Three parts, three three bosses, three segments of areas to go to. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna put this here down and yeah, interact with the world. Pretty excessively elaborate just to get a fucking ladder down. Couldn't just, you know, hit it with your slingshot like fucking Legend of Zelda or some shit. We're gonna go over to the left here and on down this way. So we're gonna go fight some optional bosses. Yay! More assholes to ignore or, you know, get fucked by, whichever one happens first. Doesn't really matter. Um, I'm actually, am I, I don't know, I think I'll, I think I'll keep with 
what I have going for now. Doesn't seem to be doing all too bad. But, um, yeah. Poison and other spooks here. If you want to fucking rage quit, something like that, that's the only way to lose. The only way to game over. Rage quit. Rage quit and never come back to it. Which I never recommend. <laughs> you can do it. You can beat the game. It's really not that hard. It's just challenging. And the learning curve is really steep. Whatever. You know, we'll fucking. We'll, we'll do things. So these knights are assholes. I love their armor though. That's pretty much black. Although the armor that you get isn't actually like the blue uh, colored one, it's actually red. Which is a little disappointing because the red one doesn't look as cool. Good. So yeah, this is Osiris, the consumed king here. Uh, he's basically the king of Lothric, but uh, he's uh, looking more, looking more monster-esque these days. Okay, I think I'm gonna actually swap out a weapon here. Mid fight. Yeah, this will be great. Okay. Is that gonna work? Yeah, I can also. Oh, not that way. Oh, could you fucking, you know, not do that? I appreciate not that. That's a little better. Okay, could you seriously? I believe your uh your baby's hurt there. Mm -hmm. You could, you know, stop being less of an asshole. That'd be great too. I can just you know, Oh god, yeah, spin the winds. Always. Always, always. Just hit him in his ball sack there. Extra damage, right? Something like that. That's not very nice. I don't like it when you do that. Man. Oops. 
Okay. Oh, all right. Or not. But you know, you can do without it, because you're from fucking Dark Souls, so, you know, whatever. And then just random baby noises. Alright. Good. So there's that. Now... Here comes the fun part. This is where the bosses start getting a little crazier. And, well, I mean, between Osiris and the Dancer, they, they were enough to make me rage quit a couple of times each during my first few playthroughs of this. This next boss, though, oh my fucking god. I've had more than my fair share of rage quits. Of this motherfucker. <clears throat> this guy right here. Actually, not really. He's just a random enemy. Um, here's where you would get a uh, Path of the Dragon set, which is kind of important for an area later. Why is this untextured? I don't fucking... Okay. Dark Souls, whatever. Maybe my great game will crash soon. I don't know. Here's an item here. And then here's a secret. Oof! So, now we're at the Untended Graves, again, where our journey began, since it's looking kind of different. I'll be right back, because I'm going to go reset the game, make sure it's not going to fucking crash on me while I'm doing shit. Be right back. So we're back, and, uh, yeah, restarted the game, just to make sure nothing funky was going on. It seems all good. As you can see, I equipped the uh, Demon Fist plus 5, because I'm going to be doing some uh, fucking parrying here. Hopefully. Um, with this boss is a champion. It's all good. Yeah. shit out of her. Or not. Oh! Okay, then. Well, there is that. <laughs> Your fucking turn, bitch. How do you like that? Oh, my God. Ouch. That kind of Oh! <laughs> well, I... Oh, maybe not. Here, I thought I was in a pickle for a minute. We don't actually have to fight her. She's not worth fighting. For the most part. Oh. oh, could you not? Don't hurt me. But yeah. And hello, folks. We are back. I uh, had a uh, call I need to take... So, anyway, as you can see here, we have fucking Gundir again. This guy can't shoot for fuck. Um, so, yeah, um, we're going to be doing parry tactics on him. Hopefully this will work. My message was raided, so I don't need to fucking heal myself. Imagine that. Magic. But, yeah, this boss is <laughs> pretty rough to start with. He's, he's worse than he was before. Extremely, extremely aggressive. Eh, eh, no! I'm not... Use the parry tactics, Luke! Except don't fucking parry him at all! God damn! There we go, fuck off. Jesus. Oh shit, okay, you just fucking donkey punch me in the face, whatever. Oh man. 
Yeah, so this is just a little bit rough. Oof, don't, do not, do not. I'm, oh, okay. He's kind of really shitty. <laughs> yeah, fuck off with that. Calculated, kinda. Oh, fuck. Here we go. This is the bad part. Oh! I don't know how many times I've had him kick me right off the fucking side of the head. He's really, really mean. So, um, definitely had more than one <laughs> just fucking turn off the PC rage quit with this guy. Um, I can't parry your foot when it fucking hits the ground. I don't think I can hit it at all, to be honest. Parry it I can hit it, but it just won't do any good. Oh, good. Yes. Use all of my stamina. No! Fuck me. Well, that's one death. Awesome. Be right back. He goes into his second phase so early, too, so he's... He's auto... Wow! Holy fuck, he just fucking wombo combined me right up the dick hole. Shit! This boss. This boss. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> no! No! Holy shit, round four. Hopefully this will work out well. Probably not, but we'll see. Yeah, yep, yeah, I'm gonna get my ass kicked. I almost died just getting here. These fucking people. Oh. Yeah, you got your fucking uh, 400 souls there. Oh my god, what the fuck is up with these berries? It's just so bad. I swap my weapon again. Uh <laughs> How about not? Not. Don't want it. Get this fucking out of my neighborhood. Cheap piece of shit. Oop. Oh, I'm just a cock. I'm a cock. He's a cock too. Oh! 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 <laughs> eh, no. Eh, eh. I don't want it. No! No! I don't want it, I don't want it. Oh my god, you gotta be shitty. You can't fucking... You can't win with this boss. You can't win. Well, you can, but... He's really fucking hard, and I don't want to fight him. Ah, he punched me right in the dick hole. You know what? Go fuck yourself, you dick. Cock McFuck. Uh, I can't parry that, you cock sucker. Oh my god, the fucking wombo combo. Stick your dick right in my dick. Oh. Did you fucking not be a cock sucker? I would appreciate that. Well, not you being a cock sucker, but just not being a cock in general. Cocks. Man, there's so many dicks in this game. Nope. Get parry, bitch! And you know what? I don't even give a fuck. Fuck you, ass fuck. Or, okay. Okay! Okay! Okay, right. Dark Souls does whatever. Fuck you. Oh my god. Oh! 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 Light that fucking bonfire, baby. Oh my god. That hurt my butthole. Like, I, I, I think I need to go to the doctor. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck. So, yeah, that's the, the, all of the bosses for this episode, but I'm gonna go ahead and just explore the area ahead and sort of explain it. Uh, excuse me. After I, uh, get my fucking shit together. Get all your shit together, man. Fucking... Do I have everything? I don't even know. The flames guide you. Whatever. Good. We'll open up this door. This is an entirely optional area. As was the previous two. <laughs> Uh, we've got some fucking Dark Knights here. Which are a lot easier to deal with than Dark Mostly. 
Oh my god. <laughs> They're still scary though. <laughs> As you can see, we've made it to Firelink Shrine, but uh, with Dark Souls and how weird time works, we basically walked into another time. So, as you can see, the shrine handmaiden's still here. Well, fancy that. A lost lamb wandereth in with nary a peep from the bell. Well, thou shouldst my purpose know. What can this old handmaid provide thee? So, she actually uh, has her own stuff to sell, uh, particularly the Wolf Knight set. You know, because you want to you know, fucking play through his uh, fucking what's his face there? I can't remember his name. Oh my god, somebody kill me! Um, well, yeah, we'll buy whatever. Doesn't matter. She also sells a ring. That's not all too important. Um, however, something that may be important to you. Is that over here, normally there would be an opening, there is not here, until you make an opening. And down here you can find a dead firekeeper. With the eyes of a firekeeper, also known as just fucking blueberries. And, uh, these are actually used for a different ending. If you give them to the firekeeper, she'll, uh, offer some, uh, services to you. So, yeah, there's that. As you can see, though, the lords aren't here either. Well, I mean, we have a couple of them in our inventory, as is. But, you know. So. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. And then the next one will maybe fail some more. I don't know. Bye bye